I, what about the, the, you know, I mentioned, Eamon, about the fact that, you know, apparently well, Southgate wanted to be on this side of the draw and he was told by loads of people, and we, we all saw it. If you look at who was on both sides, this is the yeah, place to be. Of course. But, you know, OK, Sweden or whoever was going to be in that quarter final is certainly easier than some of the other options. But th these guys are a serious team. And th this could be thrown back at Southgate if this goes wrong tonight. Well, um, the other side of the draw has uh, Uruguay, France. Brazil, Brazil mm. France, Belgium. It's no, there's no issue. Yeah. It, this is by far the easier side of the draw. And um, really, you couldn't dream of an easier route to the final. Uh, and if they get to the final, it would be a rise, Sir Gareth, <laughs> and Sir Harry, and all that. And they, you know, it'll be a remarkable story. And I think this game is huge. I think the, the, prize, the prize for the winner is amazing. Sweden, the quarterfinal of the World Cup. We, we drew Sweden in the Euros yeah. and would have beaten them or could have beaten them. So that's what you're looking at. Now, whether that weighs on the England players or not, I don't yeah, know. That's the test. It's, it's whether it's they can big, handle it. It's mm. whether, whoever can handle it. And yeah. if you're asking me for a prediction, you haven't yet, Dara. I'm, I'm building up to it. I'm okay, building up to it. I can see it, it coming. <laughs> I'm making my no. I'm not going to No, I said, no we'll come, hold, that, hold that thought for a moment because, look, let's just deal with the, with the pressure. Like, what is it, what's your, your gut feelings about whether or not they will be able to cope with this massive pressure that's on them? I think the biggest thing which could fill them really is thinking that they're in the easiest side of the draw because they are if they win this match but they need to win this match for us yeah. and they can't look any forward in this because Colombia, as Liam says, they've performed really well in the, in the group stages and they look like they're a real threat, they look a solid team defensively as well and um, yeah, whoever wins this will fancy getting all the way to the final I think. Um, so as much as the pressure is on England, the Colombians also, they'll be looking and thinking they have a massive chance to go all the way and, and win, win a World Cup, so it's, a, it's, such, it's such a difficult game to predict because it is, if England come out and I really enjoy watching England, how they've played in terms of the freedom they play with and the attack and flair, if they come out and do that and produce it and, and blow Columbia away in the first 20 minutes, well then you'd, yeah. you'd put your hands up and say that's yeah. brilliant. If the game progresses longer and longer, then holes start started appearing in your defence and little gaps open up and that's when Colombia can take advantage. So, Lingard, big player for England tonight, you know. Yep. I think he is one player that's playing with a lot of confidence, although he missed two or three very good chances in the first game. But that goal he scored against uh, Panama will give him a lot, of, you know, a lot of belief and a lot of confidence. And he is a player that can open up uh, a defence. And if he makes chances for Harry Kane, well then he will take them. But I think they will struggle, Dara. Uh, uh, all in all, I think Colombia might just take them 2-1. 2-1. Eamon? Well, I, I think it, it'll be a draw. I think that there's a reason. I think England's defensive setup will get them in a mess. And I think Quintero may control the game for large parts. I also, I'm be bearing in mind what Liam said about Ospina, I think Harry Kane will score. I think it'll be a 1-1 draw. Uh, and a penalty shootout, which I predict Colombia will win. Well, England supposedly have already picked their five guys to take the penalties in the shootout, so maybe we'll see that tonight or another night, or maybe we won't see it at all. Uh, Richard? Um, I'm hoping it's going to be something like last night. I think uh, England have great power going forward. Um, I enjoy the way they play, and I think, I think they might scrape it today. I think they might go 3-2 after extra time for England. Well, OK, so we're ordering out. Grant. All right. <laughs> <laughs>